Sand Creek, located just outside of Beulah, Wyoming, is an easily accessible blue ribbon trout fishery loaded with tough to catch brown trout, with a few of these guys stashed away in parts of it too. Since you are wondering, this one was 23.6 inches and 6.24 pounds. The Wyoming Game and Fish Department manages this stretch of Sand Creek, which feeds the Belfouche River, as a wild fishery, meaning it's never stocked. It doesn't need it. Sheridan Fisheries biologist Andrew Nykirk. Sand Creek is one of our most populous fisheries as far as number of fish per mile. We routinely generate estimates of five to 6,000 fish per mile. Most fish are between the eight and 12 inch mark, but we do get some of the bigger ones in the, in the three to four pound range. The Game and Fish electrofishes Sand Creek every other year, doing what are called depletion estimates to get a clear read on the health of the fishery. The same segments of creek are electrofished three times. The first pass catches the bulk of fish. Each subsequent pass catches fewer fish. We catch every fish that we can within that reach, and then when we get back to the office in this winter, we'll generate our estimates and compare those estimates of this year to past year sampling and get an idea of trend and how, how the fish are doing. It's safe to say the fish are doing well, but that doesn't mean catching these guys is a gimme. Habitat here is good, and the browns and smaller numbers of rainbow trout can sometimes get picky. Sand Creek is also part of the department's Extreme Angler Program, developed to encourage anglers to visit streams where in-stream flow water rights have been secured. Access here isn't a question. There's abundant walk-in access in addition to game and fish property. Limits, like the fish numbers, are healthy. 12 brown trout per day or in possession, while rainbows are catch and release. Flies and lures only on the department's Ranch A public fishing area. Even though the snow has already started flying in some parts of the state, there's bound to be a few nice days yet before winter fully sets in. So grab a fishing pole and get in some fishing. This is Ray Hageman with the Wyoming Game and Fish Department.